babe. Um, I don't think I have any left. Just ask about the hot one. Make one of them coffees like yesterday. That was amazing. Yeah, so good morning. Uh, I don't know what day it is here. Uh, Wednesday. I don't know how many days we've been living here so far. First thing is trying to move this bad boy. So, Katret went over to these guys this morning and is speaking with them now and see if I can quick come over here, pick this sucker up, put it back down there. They want to make 20 bucks for breakfast to be a good way to, for them to start the day. Um, yeah, slept better. It's just rough sleeping on the ground. It was a nice, nice and cool. It's cool this morning. I was actually kind of cold last night, but it felt great. Um, yeah, that's all I have for right now. I'll talk to you later. Goodbye. Corn. Here's your present. Yeah. <laughs> Love you. So we currently have no power, no electricity. So the guys are starting to paint. And do a little bit of morning to fill in. Uh, well, they framed out our toilet. Way smaller than I thought it was going to be. Very small toilet. Yeah. This got some man here. It's filling in holes. Boom. Never you your birthday, girl. How are you doing, birthday girl? Start painting. Go for it. Getting into it. Do a little painting action. Weird. 
it's bought. This is someone's house. I don't really know why you'd want. I don't. You can't really see it very good, but there's like a cow and a Buddha. I'm gonna zoom in on this. Just weird. Very weird. Okay, let's do an update. Tell me where we are. We are in the bathroom okay. right Okay. Tell me more. Use your bathroom. Yes. Where's the toilet? Let me know where. Here's the Here's the shower. Where's the sink? Finally, we have a sink. We have a sink. Okay, we've been living in the last apartment for nearly, nearly six years now, over five years. Almost, almost six years. Five, five plus years. We don't have a bathroom sink. So, if I brush my teeth. It's in the kitchen sink. Well, now we don't have a kitchen. <laughs> now we don't have a kitchen sink. We don't have a kitchen sink, but we'll have a sink in the toilet room, which is a huge deal for me, at least. It's very, very small, tiny living. My goodness gracious! It's like here's my arm. Yeah. Yeah, one meter. So three, three. 3.3 3 feet. 3 point something feet. 3 feet something. This tiny. 4 feet. Tiny elms. So they got the door put in, the frames put up. This side's all mudded. So yeah, tiny home. That's all that matters. They busted out the spray gun before and sprayed all these. So these are all black. All that stuff is black. Perfectly painted. Cambodian style, perfect. Just like near perfect, but not. Mud is pretty much done on most of this. Next time you see us, the house will probably be near ready to paint. So, until then, there's the gun. So we've been driving around for, what would you say, an hour? At least an hour trying to find a place that makes a piece of metal like this. To make a foundation of To make the foundation so we can finally move the container, get the container on the foundation. We still can't do it. For some reason, the truck thinks that she drives. She'll get lucky. I mean, we can film a video and It's fine. Okay. Fine. Happy birthday. Okay. This is the local market. smell what I'm smelling right now. Thank God there's no smell of it. Thank 
he's is selling the um, uh, uh, seafood. Rice. Yeah. We are on the sixth road right now. Normally we wear helmets, but mm. I think we're gonna go this far. We're right here at a scrap metal place. I think it's a scrap metal place, and they got uh, this oven thing. Corn cooking. A bunch of random scrap metal. Here's the shop. I think that's perfect. Yeah. This one I'm going to be bigger than our clock. That's perfect. Our pole. But like they say, one man's junk is another man's treasure. That's my cutter, pork thing. Container. I have to invest in one of those bad boys. Careful, little kids. Okay, make it out. This grill is making something that smells really, really good. It doesn't look that good. These are chicken feet with uh, chilies and 
duck feet. Duck feet, there's a little bit of chicken wings over there maybe. But if you could smell this one, this smells really good. It just looks, looks interesting. It smells so good though. This is our kitchen on the street. We've got the uh, metal shop here. Keep it nice, nice hot. Steady's just hanging out in the hammock, dressed like it's winter time. Touch it up. Touch it. Are you cold? <laughs> you look like you are. What else we got? We got noodles. A little bit of Got this fancy little fan blowing on her. These things are good. These little barbecue peanuts. Cheapest cigarettes you'll ever find. Of course, they have to have lots of Tiger Balm. Fish flavored stuff. We finally got the metal cut. We're finally gonna go home. We're back to the land. We're not gonna go home tonight. It's not gonna happen. It's already four. Uh, and they show up tomorrow. They, they leave tonight at five, so it's not gonna happen. Look at her. Mm -hmm. Chef Boyard. Perfect. Chef, delicious. Okay, so we finally made it back to CM Reef for this evening. Out of focus, just like my wife is right now. Still not focusing. All right, Jono. It's got everything in there. Look at this. What are you talking about? Four man tarly, one dollar fifty. Chicken curry, chapati, lime pickle. We're finally back in town for one hour. Happy birthday, babe. Yeah, Tom uh, Brady. Yeah. Oh, is it to your good lady? Indian Happy food birthday. is coming Happy your way birthday. soon. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Oh, it's all of oh, your, your, your I, I like fucked hands. Like not a single one of us. <laughs> at any moment, compromised during that time. No, I don't know. Ben and I were doing TV one, but I don't know what you were doing. Uh, yeah. Yeah. If you do what? If you play your cards right, you've got pink flowers. Play your cards right, you get a little bit. Hello, Slade! Hey, it's me! Oh my god! her birthday and she's sitting here giving me a massage. Uh, something is wrong with this picture, but thank you. Uh, yeah, the paint these guys put on the walls is really, really thin. And I just hope it holds up. I don't know how many... Put like 14 coats of this paint or 16 or 25 coats of this paint, it should be fine. Otherwise, they could have just used two coats of it or three coats of it, um, just regular without thinning it up to like a six tooth. I swear they put six gallons of water to five gallons of paint. I didn't see them mix any water, I didn't see them put the water in. I saw them stirring it and I was like, what the hell? What is this? Is that? I mean, it's paint everywhere. If you have thick paint, you won't get that. So, this leads us to the next thing. The next thing is Patreon. I don't know how it works, I don't really know what it is, but I know it's a way that we can make an income from making these videos. 
None of us have a job. You need entertainment. To build a house like this doesn't cost very much money in this country. Um, I can get a 40 foot container delivered to my house for $3,000. That's just bare, regular shipping container. And then do the inside myself. I paid $3,500 for this one. 20 feet. Um, this one's also 8 feet wide and 8 feet tall. The other one is uh, 40 foot, would be 40 feet long, 8 feet wide, and 9 feet tall. It's 8 foot 6 inches to be in. figure this out we can build a bigger home and you can be along with us the whole time and enjoy the entertainment hopefully this is hopefully this content you're 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 enjoying this one is kind of bs because we have cambodian cowboys doing it cambodian style cowboy style when i do this with my crew ben and ellie's with Gage, maybe, at least Ben and me, this will be top notch. We will become famous because of these shipping container homes that we're gonna build. I promise you this. If you subscribe, if you like, if you put money on the Patreon, I will make money and make more content for you. Build shipping containers in Cambodia, hopefully for the rest of our life. So, gives us a career, future career, retirement. I'm my retirement. I'm no longer a teacher. I got fired from being a teacher, laid off from being a teacher because of the good old virus. So, because of that, uh, it's a, I'm rambling now. Anyways, give you a shot. Show you the full moon, full zoom, looks crap on the iPhone, but there she is, there's her light.